Baby girl, you the one I adore. Your love bring me serenity. Every night I pray for I sleep because I found you. Love you. No, no, God, I do this for real. Can't tell you the ways you made me feel. I wanna love you for life. My future, my wife. You leaving, I'ma miss you. My loving ain't an issue. You rockin' with a bitch. What, what up, up Mitch Mafia? Mafia? How, How are you guys, guys feeling today? today? I hope blessed, of course. As for me, y'all, I am feeling blessed. I feel good. How you feeling, baby? I feel good. Why are you feeling good? Because it's vliggity vliggity vlog, man. Day, Day 13. 13. See? <laughs> You know, I'm on it. All right, you know. I'm on it. Oh, you was, gave me a man. I was about to say, hold up. How you give me a man that? With the nails. So as you guys can tell by this <laughs> title, today we're gonna be giving you guys a story oh. time about <laughs> about something that happened in high school. Yes, and we have ears and eyes to protect. So there's certain things that you guys are just gonna have to read in between the lines, okay? Because there's just certain things that. You know, it's hard to not to. It's not hard to talk about between us, but we do have kids now, and now it's like, uh, please don't ever do what I did, okay? Please. <laughs> but yeah. So well, you ain't do nothing. No, but still, it's just. Okay. They're, they're gonna see. They're gonna understand. Yeah, you was innocent. You was an innocent bystander. Oh uh, yeah, I guess. So yeah, we got a juicy story time. Nah, yeah. Thinking of it like <laughs> going back in time now, it's it's funny. It I mean, hilarious. it's been funny, but. It's yeah. even more funny now. No, during that time, it was real. It got real. It wasn't real. It got real to me because I was in my feelings, y'all. And you guys are going to understand why I was in my feelings. Um, y'all going to be like, yeah, I would have been in my feelings too. You know what I mean? So I was in my feelings at that time. And I just, you know how when you're young and you just feel like your whole life is just crashing now. You feel like everybody's <laughs> against you. You just feel like. <laughs> That's how you felt? I didn't know you felt yeah, like that. Yeah, I felt like just defeated. You wow, know? I didn't I know you felt, felt like that. Yeah, All I did, and years. I felt disrespected. I felt violated, even you though did? None, even though none of it was true. You guys are gonna. You never told me that. Yeah, I, I, never, I, I, I thought like we laughed about it like the next week. We did laugh about it, but I felt like, like it was true when it wasn't. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like now nah, I got a bad rep. I'm not even like that. You know what I'm saying? No, it's it's funny, but you guys are going to understand what I'm saying. Nah, that's funny. Um, but yeah, let's get into the story time. All right, but before we get into the video, make sure you guys smash that like button. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on your post notification bell so you get every single vliggity vlog. All right, so first we're going to rewind back all the way to 2000 and what? I think it was Seven. like, nah, it had to be like 2008. We was already back. We was in that temp grade? I think so. I think it was 2008. Well, 2007, 2008. Let's just go with that. Yeah, yeah. This was either ninth or 10th grade. Yeah. So, my friend... All right, before you get into that, hold up. Okay. Because we got to give them the background background. Okay, okay. All right, so, in middle school, y'all... <laughs> In middle school. Oh, you about to reveal everything? Hey, this is crazy. This, but this is this, where, this is the part where I was like, you know, we have to protect the eyes and okay, the ears because gotcha. you know you got to be really careful with it. You know what I'm saying? This is not to judge anyone. You know what I mean? But just me being me. In middle school, I was very curious and I was just, you know, I was just living my best life, young girl, just outside. I hit a lot of things. I was a liar. All these things. In middle school, I um, middle school she was a whore. <laughs> Oh no. In middle school, I was dating a girl. And this girl was actually my best friend. And it went from best friend to girlfriend. Girlfriend turned into, it became really, really toxic. Yeah, I'm talking was about toxic. real, real toxic. And that was just a stage in my life. Again, I was curious and all, it was a whole bunch of things. But we're not going to get no more deeper into that. But that carried into high school. In high school, that's when I met Sheik. Yeah, so in high school, she met me. Mm -hmm. And me and Sierra had a lot of things going on. I mean, it was nothing, but it was a lot of things going on. It was nothing, but it was something. Yeah, so I have I got this friend that made his soul rest in peace, my friend John. He went to a high school that was down the street from our high school that that girl had went to. And he asked me, he was like, yo, Sheik, you know this girl named blah, blah, blah? 
Wait, but babe, you jumping straight into it. You have to really give the deets because I okay. am giving the deets. This okay. is how it started. Okay, but first of all, it was nothing, but it was something. It's like Sheik and I were actually dealing with each other. You know, like he was my bull, I was his bull, and the the word started to go around crazy. Everybody started to know she can see sees a thing. You know what I'm saying? She can see our they're a thing. They're a thing. Mind you, we're what 15 years old, 16 years old. They're a thing. They're a thing. So that that pissed off a lot of people, including her. It pissed off people on her side. Yes, because I wasn't only just dealing with her. <laughs> she so was dealing with somebody I was dealing else. With, yes, too. I was dealing oh, with yeah. somebody else that I was dealing with for a long time, and I couldn't let that go. So this is where it gets mixy and messy because. That was my life at that time. You know what I'm saying? So I was dealing with her, but I was also dealing with that with the other person. And I wasn't trying to let that other person go ever. Like, I thought that was my forever. You know what I'm saying? So I'm dealing, you know what I mean? So now I go to high school and now I'm dealing with him. So it got to ears. It got to her ears. Go ahead. You can finish telling. And then I'm going to jump to my part. So it got to her ears. So she met Sheik and then everybody gets clipped. That's it. That's how it went <laughs> into the story. All right. So it got to her ears and it got to his ears. And then what? Well, we don't even got to talk about... Because he was there too. No, but we're talking about, we talking about John now. We're not talking about that situation, or are we? That's the situation we're about to go to right now. Oh, really? Yes. With them coming to the school? Yes. Oh, I didn't know that. All right, so yeah. So, oh, okay, so you got to so explain this. Yeah, so I'm explaining it. So John asked me, my friend John, he asked May his soul rest in peace. He was like, yo, you know this girl named blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, I already heard about her. Because somebody else told me about her. Ciara didn't even tell me. He didn't know nothing about the girl. No, somebody told me about no, her. No, but I never told you about the girl. You never told me, but I knew already. Right. And I like I probably told you about it like, yo, but this is... No, you didn't tell me. This is my first time I've seen that person in person. Like, I've seen pictures. And I'm mm -hmm. like, what? She looked like John. <laughs> it's, it's so funny, though, because they, they kind of resembled each other. John was like, yo, you know such and such? And I'm like, I don't know her, but I heard of her. And she was like, he was like, oh, she's saying that Sierra's her girl. And I said, she is. She, I said, she is. I said, that's funny. <laughs> and he was like, yo, bro, let me tell you something. Before we get here, I got to, y'all got to, y'all going to have to read between the lines. All right, so he started telling her. Like, yeah, my boy Sheik be blah, blah, blah in the staircase and mm -hmm. all this crazy stuff just, to get, that, her, just that. to get her upset. And he was like, yo, bro, when I told her that, she was shaking. Like, she was like, Ugh, Ugh, like with, with, with <laughs> anger, with anger. So, like, the next, I don't know if it was the same day or the next day or a couple days later, she came to my school. She must have went back to her block, told the guy that she was dealing with. She told him, told her uncle. All right, hold up, because that's about to get confusing. Now it's like, wait, she told the guy that she's best. Okay, now. They knew what they was dealing pause, with. Let's pause, let's pause. Let's you, pause. Got, you had the juice, though. No, nah, you let's had the pause. juice. Let's pause that. Okay. She had the juice. So, juiced the, up CC. The girl ended up. <laughs> how do I explain how they knew each other? They was from the same hood. Well, because remember, all right, this is no, they wasn't from the same hood. Well, he was chilling there, and she he wasn't lived from there. that hood. He was chilling there. She lived there, yeah. but no, that wasn't what it was. She already knew about him because remember what I said. We were best friends. We knew everything about each other. So she knew about him. She knew how serious that. She knew how serious that was. You know what I'm saying? So when we became a thing, she was like, "Oh no, like." that that's over like you have to dead die like you know what i'm saying so she did everything in her power to make sure that that was done even you know become what I mean? his even and become even his friend took it that far to become his friend yeah she tried to do that to me too but yeah so she took it she took it to the extreme and was like no we're gonna i want to be his friend and guess what they ended up being friends but they knew exactly what they were doing you know what i'm saying because of course he's hurt he's like really you know what i mean so then she's hurt so of course, they became buddies. So fake buddies. now, <laughs> they was fake buddies. no, they were actually buddies, and I, they probably still buddies. No, nah, well, that's what's up. Shout anyway, out go ahead. To them. Um, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, so you said they came to the school because I had to pull oh, you just because they're right. like, wait, how they know each other? All right, so he told me that he told he told the girl that all that stuff, and I'm like, why would you do that? He was like, yo, bro, I just wanted to get her tight because she was violating and talking about, oh, she ain't nobody. That's my girl. Blah blah blah, like. And he was like, so I got her tight. It is what it is. We walked home from school that day, and it, it was what it was. The next couple days or the next day, Ciara, um, 
Sierra, it's funny because I, my, my friend Drew came to pick me up that day. He just so happened to come that day. And Huck, uncle, all his friends. May and he rest in peace too. Her uncle, all his friends, and the guy that she was dealing with, and the girl that she was dealing with, was all outside. So now we both about to walk out. She was like, Sierra was like, no, please stay inside, stay inside. So me, like a like an idiot, stays inside. I mean, I was listening to her. But in the long run, I'm like, yo, I feel mad soft. Like, I'm really hiding in the school right now. <laughs> but I'm they went, okay, so they was waiting for him outside. And at that time, I'm just like, all three of them, you know what I'm saying? Like, they're not about to do him filthy. They're not about to jump him. I, we're not doing that. And he really stood inside the building for me. Because I was like, just don't go outside. Like, stay with me inside the building. And because I know, I, I know for a fact that he didn't step out those doors because of me. You know what I'm saying? Because if I would have just been like, you know what? I would have came just, outside. They would have had to spank me because I, I would have went outside. Like I know, but this was, he, he yeah. You stood, in the, you stood in the school because of me. I was scared. You was not they scared. They were going to jump me. No, he wasn't scared at all. He was just like, no, I'm going outside. Like, I remember him like, no, I'm going outside. You bugging. I'm, I'm going outside. I'm like, no, you're not. Like, please, just stay in the school with me. Because I didn't want, I, I know my uncle. You know what I'm saying? I know my uncle. If I didn't know what they were going to do, I know my uncle. He would have been the first one. And they would have got it. They would have ended up fighting. And regardless of what, that's my uncle. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, I really didn't want that. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, no, please. That would have looked bad on you, though. That would have looked crazy. But I would, it's crazy because I would have not been mad at you. I would have probably wanted to fight her after. Like, nah, we got to get yeah, it Yeah, no, I'm like, nah, that would have looked crazy. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just like, you know what? Just to I would have just this. took my L like, all right, it's cool. Get my whipping. No. They would have smoked me. Nah, they, they would have smoked me. They were just me and Drew outside. They would have smoked me. Stoney was out there, nah, too. Nah, I would have not let them do that to you. They, they would have had to smoke nah, me. Nah, I would have not let them do that to you. But they yeah. would have had to beat me up, too, because I would have been like, nah. <laughs> they would have had to beat me up, too, and they nah, would so, not do that. So. Long story short, so I ended, <laughs> I, All right, so going back to it, I end up coming outside, and she's standing in front of the school, pissed off. She's tired. Arguing with her. Yeah. I come out, I'm smiling, I'm like, why she, I, I already know why she mad, but I didn't know that she ran off and told everybody all of this. Mm -hmm. So now everybody's like, they, I don't know what they thinking, like, is it true? Like, or oh, whatever. So I come outside and she's just there like, yeah, so your friend told me, blah, 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 is that, I just want to know, is it true? And Ciara was like, it don't matter what I'm doing, <laughs> spazzing on her. And I was like, oh, I just left. I just bounced. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he left. I just bounced. I'm like, I'm not getting in the middle of that. No, because at that point, that's like, I was already done with her. Like, I was already done. It was, it was already like. But we, you made her think that all happened. of that was true. You was like, it don't matter what I'm doing. Yeah, because I, I was, was like, we already had got to a very toxic place, like very, very toxic place. And I was already just over it, like so over it. I'm like, what am I doing? You know what I mean? And no disrespect to her. Like she's she was always good to me, always, always good to me. So no disrespect to her or her family. They were always so good to me. You know what I mean? But that was just again, that was just a. a that was just I don't know. It's just a part of my story. You know what I mean? And. Yeah, we all got stories. Uh, yeah, you know, we got we got stories. We have a past, and we're not perfect. You know what I mean? Um, but, yeah, so it was crazy. At that point, I was already done with her, and the guy that I was with only found out about Sheik because of her. So I was even more saltier about that. I was so pissed because she literally was just like, she yeah, she's doing that, she's doing that, she's doing that. I'm like, ah. She yeah, on so you. she yeah, she definitely snitched on me. She, she snitched on you. Man. She messed and it wasn't just with you, it was just like with anybody. Like she didn't want me talking to nobody. Like she was just not with nothing. And that's when I knew I'm like, okay, yeah, this is crazy. She's selfish. <laughs> she wants you all to herself, I yeah, swear. Crazy. It was crazy. It was crazy. But yo, that was so that was a crazy time in my life. And again, you guys see why I was just like that was a point in my life where I just felt like my whole world was just crazy crashing down because it was just so much happening it was like left and right just drama it was like my life was full of drama well i was supposed i was supposed to be there to pull you out those situations so i came right on time no you did you really did i came right on time because once i made up my mind like i i remember calling chic and i was just like i want to no. be your girl you didn't yeah. call me i was with you at your job no no For you real? was at the gym i was you was playing ball mm. 
Yeah, you was playing ball, and I remember being in my room, and I called you, and you was like, hello? I was like, I wanna be a girl. And you was like, what? I'm like, I wanna be a girl. I remember that. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> I remember that, and look, here we are today, now, almost 17 years later. Now that's we crazy. back, oh damn, we've been, <laughs> that, that is crazy. Though. Right? Nah, that's crazy. That yeah, is that, crazy. That story was definitely, like we could sit back and just laugh about it. Like I could give everybody high fives now, and we could probably all sit down and laugh about yeah, it. Yeah, all laugh about it, and you know, not feel no type of way about it. Like, yo, we was really, you know, and then they would all talk mad smack to me, like, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you really had everybody like that? Like, <laughs> like what's wrong with you, you know? But it's all love. It's all love. It will always be all love. And yeah. now, look at us, older now. Ain't we no in beef. our 30s. No, never. No, no beef at all. But that's hilarious. Oh, my goodness. When she was like, you, um, we should talk about that, that John story. John being his friend. May his soul rest in peace. And I was just like, yo, that's crazy. Because I didn't really remember too much of it. And then I'm like... Nah, we gotta talk about that because that was a time. Yeah, yeah, nah, that, that was. <laughs> that funny. was a time because that's just that's just a little bit of that. You know what I'm saying? That's just a little bit. Like, oh my goodness, yo! I remember one time. This is a whole nother story time, but I probably wouldn't even do that. But I remember one time when I was in a different high school before I even got to the high school that Sheik was in because I was I was a transfer student because my school my first high school was too far. My mom didn't want to. She didn't want me to be on the train so early in the morning by myself so she was just like she had a cop friend that and the cop friend say hi hey chicken head <laughs> she, all right baby we talking so she had a cop friend and that was able to uh, transfer me without them needing so much information they gave us safety transfer so that's what they did <laughs> they, they did gave, i think it was a safety uh, transfer they, but nothing happened they jumped us no school. nothing happened i actually liked my school i was just meeting friends it was really nice it was in harlem it was a really really nice school i was just meeting friends and then i was just like you know what, whatever i'll switch so i ended up switching in the middle of the year it was january Perhaps. right after christmas and I, well, I remember being in the other high school and both the guy and the girl came to the school to torture me. They did? Yes. They came They came to the school. They were both waiting for me outside. I walked past, walked right past both of them. <laughs> I walked right past both of them. They followed me on the train. Sorry, y'all. The memory card is full. But yeah, so I forgot the last thing I said. Yeah, they were, they were torturing you me. Like, they, they were... It was just... They love to do that. They just ended up loving to do that. It was a mess. They probably like this look on your face like, you ain't talking to nobody. <laughs> it's a mess, a mess. But anyway, y'all, that is the story time. Crazy story time. It's so funny because I was just telling Sheik, I was asking Sheik, like, babe, like, we got to do some story times. Like, what have you, we got to talk about things we've been through. And we both looking at each other like, what have we been through? 17 years, we've been through a lot. It, it, there is a lot, but like, to actually like really think about like those, you know, those highlights, because yeah. these are highlights, you know what I'm saying? Like highlights in our lives that shaped us to be, you know, the man at, well, I said the man, the man and woman that we are today. Are you like, I knew you was a man. <laughs> no, but yeah. All right, y'all. So that is the end of Vlogmas Day I want, 13. I want to be done. We are done. Is that done? Yes. Make sure you guys smash that like button. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on your post notification bell so you can get every okay. single vliggity vlog. Every, every single vliggity vlog. You suck. We love you guys and we'll see you guys tomorrow. If y'all want more story time, leave a comment in the section below. Yes. <laughs>